morning, Crooked River. Good morning, everyone. Another week of announcements. Woohoo! I love it. Here so, we are. hey, the weather kind of getting gross. Yes. Central Oregon winter. It's winter. Yeah. White stuff on the ground. Mm hmm. Snow. At recess. It's okay if you want to play with the snow, in the snow. That's up to you. Mm -hmm. You will get wet. Mm -hmm. You will get cold. Mm -hmm. We do not have infinite amount of clothing for you to change into. So just think about those natural Get wet, stay wet. Get wet, stay wet. Yeah. Yep. Also, no snowballs. No. Snow stays on the ground, you guys. Yes. It stays on the ground. You do not make snowballs. You certainly do not throw snowballs at people. That's super fun at home. I'm not going to lie. Right. I love throwing snowballs at my kids. Actually, not true because then now they throw them back and they throw them hard. Yeah. So I really don't like doing that at home. So, but <laughs> keep the snow on the ground. Also, kicking snow. Uh uh. Snow stays on the ground. Yeah. If you build a snowman, that's darling. Building a snowman, that's awesome. fun. That's cool. Here's what you have to know you don't own the snow. This is true. So, like, if you build a snowman and somebody goes out and destroys your snowman, oh, that's not nice. But you don't own the snow. So, I mean, be respectful of what other people do. Um, but yeah. just don't let your feelings, don't get too attached. Right. So it's, it's not temporary. Olaf. It's temporary. Our snowmen are not Olaf. They aren't, unfortunately. Yeah, so. Olaf. For sure. <laughs> uh, on Monday of this week, we had some really special guests at, uh, during the specials. We had some mm -hmm. um, firemen who came and chatted with you guys um, and did an awesome job. And they said, what awesome kids you were. And so initially I was like, oh, that was so nice. And then my thoughts continued. It's so nice. And yeah, we're the best kids on the planet. So Absolutely. I know. I was really proud to hear that of you guys though. Yay. So thanks for taking that um, that really seriously. Um, we have some Firebusters winners. So when Fireman Russ was here, he left us with Papa Murphy's gift cards. These what? are like twenty bucks. Nice. 20 bucks. Oh, that's dinner yeah. for the fans. I know, for sure. And so we have a winner from every grade level. So Yay. here we go. The kindergarten winner is Blaze Bob. Blaze, come on down and get your dinner for your family. That's awesome. All right, first grade winner, Cameron Boy. Cameron, awesome. Come on down. All right, second, second grade. grade winner. Riley Schwartz, come on down. Riley, fantastic. All right, third grade winner. We've got Peyton Finney. Come on down, Peyton. Peyton. Good job. All right, no fifth graders turn in their firebusters. What? I know, so we have two fourth grade winners. Bonus so, fourth grade. Yep, okay. here we go. First fourth grade winner. Bobby Jean Bloomberg. Bobby Jean. Woohoo. And our Marshall Mills. Marshall Mills. Second, second, fourth grade. Second, fourth grade. Oh, that's what I was trying to say. Yes. <laughs> Tongue twister. It is. Nice job, guys. Thanks for doing that. Come on down and get your Firebuster prizes. Yay. Awesome. Okay. Have you seen the quilt in the hallway? So cool. The quilt of thankfulness. Yes. Oh, it is the best. It's really if cool. you haven't seen it, it's right across from the cafeteria. There's little um, quilt squares that our third grade teachers mm -hmm. put all together. Um, and it's amazing. It's if so you awesome. just stand there and look at what everybody's thankful for. I still haven't done mine. I have an idea. <gasps> this is boring. I don't know. I just don't know how to draw my idea. You're just thankful for a lot of things. Oh, though. boy. Isn't that for sure true? <laughs> for sure true. Yes. In fact, let's talk about that. Yeah. Next week is Thanksgiving. It is. So, you guys, we don't have school for an entire week. Mm -hmm. Teachers don't have school. You don't have school. It is a time for you just to get some rest. Yes, and please. Really? Better. Really, here's your homework over next week. Spend some time thinking about what are you thankful for? Because even if things don't feel very good, there's always things to be thankful for. When times are good, really when times are not good, there's always things to be thankful for. I just think whenever somebody says, you know, what are you the most thankful for? My family just always, always comes to mind. Yeah. My cool. college son will be home for an entire week and um, I just am excited to spend time with, with my family. Yeah. What are you uh, thankful for? Oh my gosh. I am so thankful for my family too. Mm -hmm. And also living out here in Oregon, we call them my family because they're oh, our friends who yes. are our family. <laughs> yes. So I'm so thankful for them. Yes. Yes. For sure. Hey, one other thing um, that I have been really thankful for mm -hmm. is your time at Crooked River. Yeah. We've really appreciated you. You've brought Thank so you. much to us in the time that you've been here. Um, so speaking of family. Oh, guys, I am so thankful that I got to be your assistant principal 
but you're not going to see me after Thanksgiving because I'm moving with my family all the way to Vermont, which is really far away on the other side of the United States, which is where clear across the country. Yeah, 3,000 miles is really far. Um, but I love you all so much, teachers, staff, families, students. You all are fantastic. You are, for real, the best kids on the planet, and I have been so lucky to be your assistant principal. So I'm going to miss each and every one of you so much. We're moving to Vermont so we can be closer to our family, for real families, too. So thanks for letting me be your assistant principal. I love you all really a ton. Yeah. I'm gonna miss you. Well, we're gonna miss you too, but we're happy for you. Thank you. We're happy for you and your daughter Emily that gets to be closer to grandma and grandpa's. And yeah, she's so excited lovely. to see that's that. That's lovely. Mm -hmm. So, uh, we have a plan. We have um, two of my friends are actually gonna come in and fill in as assistant principal, Mr. Stacy Smith. Mr. Smith will be here three days a week, and then Mrs. Jonas will be here two days a week. So, you will get to meet them um, right after Thanksgiving, and you're gonna love them. They're wonderful. Totally. They're absolutely wonderful. Yep. So you're gonna have fun with them. Yeah. Yep. They're we'll good. Okay. Let's see. Uh, we also need to do some drawings. Yeah. Let's so do let's some do memos. Let's, let's do some memos. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Five memos. We can do this. Who's it gonna be? Well, it's gonna be uh, Brody Shelton from Mrs. Beach's class. Be responsible. Good job, Brody. Fantastic. Um, we have Tatum Reidenauer from Mrs. Godap for being responsible. Oh, no. no surprise there, little Miss Tatum. Ooh, a kindness. Yes. I love this. Avery from Mrs. Nixon for helping. Mm -hmm. Yay! It makes sense to me. All right. Ooh, this one's all crumpled up. Uh, Bristol from Mrs. Beach's class for being responsible. Yay! Very nice. Okay, and our what? last memo for today is Misty from Mrs. Nixon's class for being safe. Nice. nice. Okay, job. come on down, memo winners. All right, and our big prize oh, today. Oh my goodness. We chose something that we thought might be fun over break. Yeah, yes. so. All right, here we go. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Well, it's going to be Macy from MS. Is that who's mm. MS? Macy, do you recognize your handwriting? Macy, come on down. Let's see who it is. It's Teacher like a, initial MS. It's like a mystery, Macy. I know. I'm not sure who MS is. Okay, but come on down. Respectful and responsible. Yay! Yay. Prize winning. Yes, fantastic. Good job, Macy. All right, let's do the plug of the week. I like it. Let's it is it. Friday. Please take your hats off. Mm -hmm. Please stand. Right hand over your heart. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Very good. One last plug for the, um, the kindness notes that are set up outside the library yeah. and the penny drawing. Those are also notes set up outside the library. I just saw those today. So keep working on that food drive goes through the beginning of December, so if your family wants to bring in some non-perishable food, uh, we are getting some of our barrels full. Yay! So that's really awesome. exciting. Yeah, I was happy to see that. Very cool. Have the best Thanksgiving week. Be safe, have fun, eat a lot of food. Yeah! Yeah, okay. Happy Thanksgiving. Take care.